Today I'm going to show you how to download the updated Windows 10 ISO file from Microsoft. I'll show you different methods. For starters, you need a Chrome browser, or if you can even get any Chromium browser like Microsoft Edge. I'll be using Google Chrome, so go, go to Google Chrome and open Google Chrome. Then uh, check the link in the description. Press that link. The link is going to take you straight to the download page for Windows 10. Now, uh, if you look at our download page for Windows 10, there's an option only update. I'm using Windows 11, so I cannot update. But I need to download the ISO file. So now, to, in order to download this ISO file, head and go on to the three dot menu, go to more tools, then head to developer tools. Then uh, in your developer tools, look for another three dot menu under the developer tools. Then again, go to more tools and look for network conditions. Make sure you are able to find the network conditions. Now, click on network conditions. Under the network conditions, try to look for user browser defaults. You can see this is my user browser default. Then make sure to deselect the user browser default. So I'm going to deselect this. When you deselect the user browser default next to the user agent, click on, on custom. Then under the user agent, make sure to select an agent for a mobile device. You can see we have different agents. So I'm going to look for an agent for a mobile device. So I'm going to click on this one, Android. See, when I click on that Android, okay, I'm going to come back to my page and I'm going to refresh the page. Okay, our page is refreshing now. After the page refreshing, you can see that now we are having an option to download. Okay, so what you're going to do now, head on, scroll down, and look for select edition. Then click on Windows 10 Mount Edition ISO. Then confirm. When you finish, you are going to select the product language that you prefer or any region that you want. So I'm going to choose and I'll, I'll look for the English for United States. Then I'm going to confirm. When you confirm, then you're supposed to choose what you prefer. I'm going to go for the 64 bit download. So I'll click on 64-bit download. If you want a 32-bit download, you can click on 32 bits. So I'm going to go with the 64 bits. Then I'll click that. You can see that now my updated Windows 10 ISO is downloading. It is going to take four minutes, five minutes, and it is going to download. So for the second method, I'm going to go ahead and download the Windows 10 Media Creation Tool. I'll use this tool to download the updated Windows ISO file. So in case the first method does not work for you, you can use this second method. So go ahead and click on the Download Tool now. When you finish downloading your tool, you can open up the tool. 
I would say yes. Okay, we are installing our tool. Accept. Then uh, they bring for me upgrade this PC now or create an installation media. So I'm going to click on create an installation media and I'll say next. Uh, okay, next. Then you say I saw file. Okay, then you say next. They ask if I want to save your file, I'll save the downloads, and I'll say save. Then it is going to start downloading the ISO file. So you can choose this method, or you can choose the first method. Uh, thank you. Please subscribe and hit that bell notification for more videos from us.